Hey guys, welcome to another Watch Time Review. Today I'm going to try one of these young seafood. This is the wild caught um, Pollock with uh, Pollock filet dinner with sliced potatoes, carrots, and green beans in a creamy cheese and herb sauce. So you get the fish, the sauce, the uh, potatoes, and the carrots and green beans. It all, it's all in one meal. Um, we, it says it's new. I, I, we just saw these in our area recently, so they may be brand new. I'm not sure. Uh, they're $3.94 per meal at Walmart. So that's, Young's is the only place we've seen uh, is at Walmart. So two servings in the box, half of the pack is $190. Um, so it's less than 400 calories if you eat the whole thing. So I'm not sure why they divided it up that way, but they did. So cooking direction, you can do this in the oven. Maybe it be better in the oven. I don't know. Since it's... Uh, it looked like a baked fish with a sauce on it. I don't think a microwave would make any difference anyway. So, but you can do it in the oven if you want to. So we're going to do it in the microwave. So it says actually for best results, you use microwave. Hmm, there you go. All right. So remove the outer packaging and pierce the film uh, lid. Place the tray on a microwave safe plate, paper plate. Um, cook on high for full power. Uh, center the turntable for nine minutes. So you're definitely cooking this thing for a while. It's just one big pile of stuff. Okay, there's the potatoes. Those look good. Um, so I'm gonna get this in my. I'm gonna poke a couple holes in this and get it in the microwave, and I'll be back um, in the long term in the microwave. All right, here it is out of the microwave. All I did was taking the plastic off, so I haven't even touched it yet. But it looks like the the potatoes are pretty pretty soft, well cooked. Um, the green beans and the carrots seem to be somewhat soft, and there's a piece of fish I'm assuming under here somewhere. Yeah, right there. Is that fish too? No, I think that's potatoes. I think that's, yep, that might be a little piece of fish. So I think your piece of fish is like right here. So I'm gonna let this cool off a bit because it's really hot and I'll be back. And I think it's had time to cool off. We'll see. If I burn my mouth, I burn my mouth, right? All for science. I'm trying to potato first. It's cooked okay. It's a little, um, it's a little tough and um, rubbery almost. It's like if you had uh, over here we call them fried potatoes. It's like you fried potatoes or roasted potatoes in the oven, and um, um, you let them sit out and get a little soggy. They're not bad, but they're not awesome either. They're um, they're definitely edible, but they're um, I don't know. They got they've gotten very um, chewy. So let me try a carrot and some green beans. Hmm. Those are actually cooked really well. I like how they're cooked. They're, um, the carrots are not mushy, but they're also not really, they're not crunchy either. I don't mind that at all. That's, and you know, I'm not a carrot lover, but that um, that's pretty good. I'm gonna try a potato and green bean and so I can get a carrot in here too, and a potato. I like the sauce. The sauce is really not strong. It just says uh, creamy herb and cheese sauce. It's not a really strong, like, in-your-face sauce. It's a very light um, sauce, which is probably good for fish. Fish, you generally want a lighter sauce. So here's the fish. The fish, by the way, is about that big. It's not very big. I, I thought it went around that one edge. It doesn't. It, it cuts off. Literally, it's like same that big. It's like, like that big. Like the palm of your hand, that's how big it is. So... And that, they say a palm of hand is about as much meat as you need in a meal, uh, calorie-wise, so I don't know. Anyway, here we go. It's good. It's good and tender. Uh, very flaky. The fish itself um, goes really well with the sauce. It is, um, you definitely taste the fish. It, has, it definitely has that fish flavor. Um, not as bad as, like, some fish sticks or... Um, filet fish like fresh fish but um it is a little fishy so if you're not into if you're not into fishy you probably wouldn't buy this anyway but um like tammy likes um she likes fish but she doesn't like to be overly fishy and um really strong flavor this one's getting there she might consider this a little too fishy for her i like it it um it's not quite as strong as tuna let's put it that way but it's it's right up there with tunas and tunas can be pretty strong 
Now that bite was a little stronger herb wise and that was really good. I like that. I wish all that sauce was like that. So overall, this is not bad. I would rather have their um, their fries and their, their, their fish and chips meal, um, even though it wasn't spectacular. And the uh, their fried, like their, you bake it in the oven, like their uh, fillets, um, their haddock fillets. I like those. I mean, I've eaten, bought those many times. I'd rather have that than this meal. This meal's okay. The potatoes um, aren't crispy, aren't, they're kind of rubbery. The vegetables are cooked well. I do like them. And the fish is good. It's just got a little bit of a fishiness to it and the sauce is not very strong. I wish it had a little bit more herb to it. Like I said, the one bite I got that was that had the herb flavors, I, it really went well with the fish. It was really good, strong flavor. Most of it though, I've taken like three or four bites of the fish and it didn't really get that strong herb flavor. So I wish there was a little bit more in there. So um, overall, this is an okay meal. I'm gonna give it a three. You definitely get a lot of food. Um, it is almost 400 calories, so just keep that in mind. Um, small piece of fish, but I think it's enough. If you eat the potatoes and the vegetables and the fish, I think you'll be full. So, um, see, I'll stick with a three. You could skip it if you wanted to. Um, you know, it's up to you, but, but I mean, you could try it out, but it's not just, just don't expect like spectacular flavors and quality. It seems, uh, this the microwave version just doesn't come through very well. So I hope you enjoy this video and thanks for watching.